Okay, I was curious about if I can make the sprite go on an angle when I press some of the keys. So, um, I like using the number pad when I play a game so I can move at angles as well as backwards, forwards, up and down. So this is a bonus. It's not needed for your maze game, but I thought you might be interested in it. Let me delete this. To do it is I took the one space key pressed and I changed space to 9. So you have to click on the more at the bottom then find 9. So when 9 key is pressed go into motions, change X by Y and change Y, I'm sorry, change X by 10 and change Y by 10. So now when you press the 9 key it goes in an angle. It, uh, the 9 key on the numbers pad or the other one, it, it doesn't matter. Um, I had the nums lock key pressed there is a way you could do it without the num key, uh, num lock on, but that gets complicated. So to get the sprite down, I'm going to say when the one key is pressed, change x by negative 10, and change y by negative 10. And now, oh, I put 101. Okay. And now the sprite goes down. Up, down, back, oops, back, forth, up, and down. Um, you can set any keys to do, I mean, you can set the letter J to go on an angle. But as you notice that there's one line for X and one line for Y, it really doesn't happen simultaneously. But the computer, again, works so fast that the eye doesn't see it. So that's why it looks like it's going on the angle when really it's taking a step forward then taking a step up. I thought you would find that interesting. That's it.